This year at the SIHH 2019, the new Panerai World is uh, focusing on the uh, submersible, which becomes a standalone line. For all the ones who are Paneristi or big fan of the brand since many years, you know that the submersible was a very strong subsegment of the Luminor line. And this year we have decided to create uh, a, a separated family for submersible. Not that we're going to change lots of things, but it will have a dedicated strategy for this range of products and that uh, most of the uh, innovations from Panerai under the uh, Moto Laboratorio D-Day, which is the claim of our brand, uh, is going to feed that line with uh, major innovations in terms of materials or in terms of experiences. Some of the highlights which are all about submersible this year uh, are, for example, the capacity of the brand to also associate material. Uh, if you take this watch, for example, which is a BMG with a Carbotech bezel, uh, is the association of two materials which are uh, very much associated to the latest uh, innovations of the brand the last couple of years. So the BMG is a material which is exclusive to our brand, uh, bulk metal glass, uh, which we have launched last year. Um, this metal is unscratchable and indestructible uh, and anti-magnetic, uh, but for the first time we associate it to another material which is a Carbotech with these blue indexes which we have opened, so to say, uh, to the Lab ID concept uh, two years ago. Um, so we continue our story with the Carbotech, which is uh, in that case in 47 or 42 millimeter. Um, that is a success story of the brand. Uh, some of our best sellers are associated to this material and we'll continue with that. Uh, we have a couple of pieces which are also associated to two things which are the chronograph. So one of the uh, uh, key directions for Panerai in the future is provided we are very much associated to the world of sport and diving and the performance. It's to uh, highlight the beauty to have also chronograph within Panerai. And here you have in addition the fact that we also want to diversify our offer in dials and not to have only black dials which is the roots of where Panerai comes from but we have lots of customers who are after other type of dials and we come with this greyish uh, structured uh, dial associated to this uh, uh, blue ceramic bezel in that case which is a, a titanium. So that is a, an addition which is associated to the world a champion for free diving, which is Guillaume Neri, and uh, which is bringing this edition for this for this year. Um, another one which is associated to the uh, uh, co to the experiences. So we have decided this year that the Laboratorio de Ide approach, which has been the uh, strong pillar of Panerai for the last couple of years, which has started with mo with materials, the third level now will be experiences. So we want to be a pioneer in experiences like we have been a pioneer in material on movements. On this watch, for example, you will be able to get it. Uh, it's only 15 models, uh, and you'll get it in Tahiti, in the French Polynesia, uh, while you're going to stay uh, three days with Guillaume Neri in his house, in this part of the world, um, diving with him and meeting with the whales, because we'll do that in October, which is the exact period where the whales are in this part of the world. So, and we have like that a couple, of, you know, a couple of experiences which are very much in what we want to do in the future. We have three experiences uh, for 67 of Happy Few in the world, which will be brought either as a training uh, with the uh, Marina Militare in Italy or with Mike Horn in the North Pole. Um, so, limited editions associated to experiences. Or also to say, it happens that Panerai is a brand of lifestyle experiences and this is associated to some limited editions. One of the ones to, to, to add is the uh, concept we have with uh, recycling. Uh, I think we are one of the very few brands which starts to develop its products with recycling in mind. So how we can in the future have this dimension uh, in mind, meaning if you see here three elements which are recycling. So for example, you need three bottles of plastic, uh, of plastic bottles to make these straps. Um, and these are the very first generation of straps in Panerai which are, uh, which are made of recycled, uh, recycled material. The second one is the uh, recycled titanium. 
so it's not made from scratch, but we are reusing 100% of the titanium here, which is called Eco Titanium, to make this new case. And finally, the packaging, which is a head amount of materials in our industry. And 100% of this packaging here, for example, are uh, made with different materials, all recycled. Um, in the future, I believe that this is also the mission of Panerai to protect at our scale what is, can be our contribution to protect the pollution of oceans. And also due to the uh, magnitude of, uh, of communication we have in Panerai is how we can, for the new generation also, uh, make people aware that when we are uh, buying products, uh, there is a certain share of recycled uh, components in what we are doing. My favorite uh, watch on model at that, at that fair is uh, this uh, military, Marina Military Special Edition. Here you have uh, 19 of these uh, pieces which will be available starting, uh, starting in June this year. Um, it's a Carbotech model and you will be entitled to spend two days with the Italian Marina Commando and train two days with them and you'll get the watch at the end of these two days. And I think that this is a spectacular uh, experience that uh, will be the very first to propose because uh, these guys are not used to uh, welcome uh, third parties people to do this type of training. And we are very honored to be back to what the roots of our brand has been uh, because we shouldn't forget that Panerai has started to exist in that industry by supplying and being the official supplier of, uh, uh, of instruments for the Italian military.